types of water waves. The first are surface waves and the second are tsunamis. They are formed by completely different processes. Surface waves are formed by wind blowing across the surface of the water. It is the friction between the wind and the water that makes the waves. The size of surface waves is determined by the speed of the wind and the distance the wind blows over the water. The farther and or faster the wind blows across the water, the larger the waves become. A tsunami forms when an earthquake on the ocean floor causes the floor of the ocean to lurch upwards. Water, and in fact all liquids, are incompressible, which means that no matter how much pressure you put it under, the volume of the water or the liquid will not change. This principle is how hydraulics work. Because water is incompressible, the entire water column above that portion of the ocean floor also rises. This forms a lump in the surface of the ocean. Water can't stay in that position because of gravity, so the energy that formed the tsunami and pushed up the water column, the energy from the earthquake, travels across the surface of the ocean, radiating in all directions from the point that the tsunami formed.